Hey everybody, welcome back to my celiac disease symptom number three, which is joint pain. Um, this is going to be, <laughs> oh man, did I feel like an old man sometimes. Um, but uh, first of all, I just want to mention I'm doing this so that way you guys can better understand your symptoms. That's why you're watching the video, right? So that way you can get to the bottom of what is causing them. So, um, or that would be my wish. So that way we can all feel better, uh, live our lives, right? So... Uh, again, this is joint pain. Uh, this started probably, I would say, even as a teenager, I've kind of felt like I was having these pains, you know, on and off that, um, or at least probably towards the end of high school, like to college time frame, uh, I would just wake up and I would just be like, um, I mean, it's not like I had a hangover, but I mean, sure, it felt like a hangover almost. Um, like I would just be stiff and sore. Um, and I really hadn't been doing anything. I was like, oh, maybe I'm just out of shape or whatever. Uh, but looking back now, I think it was probably, uh, my celiac disease is what was causing it. Um, but more recently, uh, so like 2018, 19, 20, uh, 21, I was really having some neck pain. Uh, and I had been going to the, uh, chiropractor and that was helping a little bit. And, um, you know, I was like, you know, I feel like it was helping, but at the same time, I knew it probably wasn't, there was something else that had to be causing it. Uh, like there was just more to the story. Um, and when I say joint pain, it's like, you know, like your neck to where your, from where your neck to your shoulder connects right here. Uh, like it was, I was just having trouble like turning my head. Um, I just feel like an old man. I'm like, I should feel like this when I'm like 70, right? Or 80. <laughs> Why do I feel like this when I'm in my late 20s? Like, I, this should be in my prime. Like, why why am I having trouble looking to my right or my left when I'm driving? Uh, so, like I said, it's the, the joint pain. And really, I mean, I didn't really have a lot of issues, say, with my legs. Uh, but I would have, like, some hip pain also. Uh, like, if I was sitting in the car for a long period of time. Uh, but, by and large, it was mostly just, like, around my neck area. Now, that's just not to say, like, somebody else couldn't have it somewhere else, uh, but that's just where mine was concentrated, was, like, around my neck area, um, and, like, kind of in my shoulders, too. Go ahead, going back to my number one symptom, uh, where we were talking about my rib pain, or, like, my shoulder blade here, um, but I think that was probably something else, so, uh, this is more of just, like I said, around my neck, uh, having trouble looking both ways, uh, it's actually a little stiff right now, but, um, by and large, it's gotten way better since going gluten-free. It doesn't bother me as much. Uh, if it does bother me, it doesn't last as long, which is great because before when I had these flare-ups, it would last like maybe a week or eight, you know, eight, ten days sometimes before it would get better. Um, and even then, I would still feel sore, but it wouldn't be as painful. Um, so I just want to leave with that. So if you haven't checked out my other videos, uh, check those out uh, on my celiac disease symptoms. Uh, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.